Michelle Bonner, and I know we all have stories about Michelle. So her parents introduced my parents to each other. So that made her my very first friend, right? And so uh, I had sleepovers at her house, and she would try to have a sleepover at my house. I, I should have sleeping up there when I was two. I was ready. She didn't get ready for about five. She would just try and then we'd take her home, you know. I, I love her so much. And um, she was in my wedding and, you know, just my longest friend, honestly, the funniest friend I would ever have. And I um, miss her. Don Petey Griffin. And I really didn't know that Don had died. Did anyone have a story about Don? I know he played some sports and did some things. Managed the football team, always helped out with that. He used to help manage you know, the football and basketball team. I mean, he was always there when he needed him and took care of everything. Always did what he needed to do. You could count on him. Got a smile on his face. Always smile. I was just thinking about that because I was in home room with him and he was always, always smiling. smiling. Yeah. Denise Morrow. Y'all remember that spin out party we had at our house? I spin out party at Denise's house? What do you remember? <laughs> Grafton Powers. I think Grafton was our first class, was he our first classmate to pass on or was that Tom Yancey? Tom Yancey. Tom Yancey. We talked about that. Um, Grafton was one of those two who always was so neat and had everything in order. And one of the things I remember about Grafton, y'all remember Coach McIntosh in PE class. We, were, we always had those competitive leagues. You know, we, we, we did go out in basketball teams here and we did go out in soccer teams and all that. You know, and sports were not Grafton's thing, yeah. right? Yeah. And so, whatever, we were, one year we were doing soccer down at the Bowen baseball field, and it was a championship game, and whichever team I was on was playing this other team, and Grafton was on that team. And he, and he would just stand at one spot, and sports <laughs> wasn't his thing, right? And he was about 10, 15 feet from the goal, and I don't remember who kicked the ball, but it bounced off of Grafton's <laughs> legs into the goal. <laughs> And they won the league and gave them bonus points in class. <laughs> and we're all sitting there going. <laughs> yeah. And what grade was that? Gosh. No, no, ninth, maybe. Ninth grade. Yeah. Um, Mike Robinson. Anybody have a Mike Robinson story? He was a great football player. He was like a water boy.
person again. I mean, really and truthfully, that's not to put a damper on anything, but it's just the facts of life that as we age, we need to really seize every moment that we can to see one another and at least remember one another. Uh, I have pictures and frames over here. I don't know that any of you will want to keep, take one or whatever. We'll keep them for the next time too. We hope we don't have to act anymore. Well, if I do, Patty, I'll come to your place. <laughs> Really? I remember that. 